All right, let's fucking do this. Yo, what's up? Welcome back. How's everybody doing? So today we got Liam vapes, and uh, today the video is going to be twenty dollar vape versus two hundred dollar vape. Show them a little closer. <laughs> hey, yeah, kapow. So this vape is the G Priv Two, and this vape is the E Leaf. E Leaf. Sorry, my English there. E Leaf I Stick. Pico. Cheers, everybody. So the reason we're comparing these two vapes is because of the price difference, uh, which is pretty huge. And the idea that you can get this vape, which is a perfectly good vape, works really nice, honestly, really like in my the, opinion. I really like the look of it. You have a nice color. It's cool. This man. is limited edition color, but if you want to go check out I'll leave a link in the description for this mod, and you can see what colors they have available. But uh, yeah, the, you can get this vape for $20, around there, and this vape is almost $200, which is ridiculous, like, to think about. Like, if you want to spend a ton of money, you get quality, I guess, you know? That thing's touchscreen, which is amazing. Look at that, guys, you can just... Let's see. The max watts you can hit this coil at is 100, so I'm going to show you guys what that looks like. You can get bigger. I'm at 50 better, watts. I mean, better coils for this. Like, you can get coils that are like, go up to like 230 watts. But you got some weak ass coil on here, dog. Yeah. Well, that's all, another thing, though. You could buy this mod and get a different tank for it. And there you go. You literally got a perfectly good mod with like an upgraded tank. This thing does really nice tricks, though. Ooh, that was sick. That was bad. <laughs> you gonna switch? Sure. Cheers, everybody. Hope you guys are enjoying your day today. Stay vaped. We're just gonna sesh for like a few minutes here. Man, I am so fucking big. Honestly, right now. guys, though, this vape is fucking awesome. Like, fits real nice in your pocket. I remember saying that in the last video. Yeah, last literally. time we did this, but. This thing's a little um, bit heftier, but. Unfortunately, that video's not up today. Mm. 100 watts, dude. Holy fuck. Okay, let me try to get at least one fucking good trick in this video. Here, let's no, yo, wait. You gotta, you gotta. Why is it not? You gotta get rid of this hot box a bit, bro. You gotta. You gotta get the air to clear. You know, you gotta Your clear wind. out the air. Yeah, you gotta clear out the wind, bro. Here, walk. look at this. Wind looks real clear. Look at this, eh? Go for it. Oh yeah. By the way, we're using my old camera right now because I don't know if you guys know, but my camera legitimately broke from falling from my bed stand onto my bed. And uh, I guess that's just my fucking luck right there. It's gonna cost me a couple hundred bucks to get her fixed, but we'll be back to uh, that quality very, very soon. A couple weeks. But as far as cloud production goes on this vape, it's quite nice. Yeah, especially for just a little guy, you know? It's just a, it's, how high does that go for water? It's just a little small guy, you know? You know, this is just a little beginner vape. The thing goes up to 50 watts, I believe. Oh, it goes up to more. It goes up to 70 watts. 75, 75. Dude, it is foggy as shit. Hope you guys enjoyed this fucking video. I'm going to end it off here. We're going to actually smoke a time bomb right now. So I don't know if you guys have seen that video, but if you haven't, it's coming soon. Drop a like on this video. Hit the notification bell. Stay baked, stay lifted, stay happy. Peace!